this is the Mosaic Diagnostics Test Kit, formerly known as Great Plains Labs. And within this kit, we've got a few components uh, that you're going to have to take apart and prepare before sending in the sample. So I'm going to pull everything out here and you're going to see what to prepare. There is a silver bag there with an ice bag, ice pack. Make sure to put it inside of there. Put it in the freezer at least 24 hours prior to doing the test. The other thing you're going to notice is a UPS uh, shipping bag. Now it already has the address populated, but in this front pocket here is a bill of lading, what it's called, or an invoice, and you're going to have to fill out. There's three of them in here, everywhere that's highlighted yellow. So basically, uh, your signature and date on three copies of the paper and you put it back in. And lastly, the test supplies. So there is a little piece of uh, paper towel here, put it inside this bag that's marked specimen bag. There's a little vial here or a, a, a jar and it's, you have to write your name on that as well. There is instructions from the lab in here and for each of the different test kits there are specific instructions so make sure you read through those as well as there is a sheet for the actual lab itself a test requisition sheet and in it you'll have to fill out the highlighted parts which is basically your signature your personal information and on the back side you're gonna have to fill in the date and time that you collected the sample and how it was stored when you're done with that sheet of paper Put it into this back pocket and now you're ready to do the test okay so the majority of the tests are basically wake up in the morning first urination catch fill up the vial screw the top on put it in this biohazard bag put it on the ice pack and ship it on a monday or tuesday it's that simple okay once you have the test kit completed you're going to put it back in the box with your sample in the ice pack you are going to place it in the bag. There is a peel, you peel it and seal it. And you've got a couple options. You can phone UPS to pick up directly from wherever your location is, which is a little bit less reliable. The best option for you is to literally drop it off at the UPS Depot, which is on Sergeant Avenue, close to the Winnipeg Airport.